Alright, so welcome back in Unreal Engine 5.02 and in this video what I'm going to do is actually turn myself into a metahuman. Now, this model came from Ganesh, the Glorious Pictures. He actually sculpted this for me. You know, Zion, you've met him before. So what I'm trying to do right now is can I rig this face mesh that he made into a metahuman using the mesh to metahuman plugin? So. Let's go ahead and get started. I have the mesh right here. And funny enough, I just used the old eyeball right here that we used in my previous video. So let's see if this works. Now I didn't scale this properly, so I'm kind of, you know, a ginormous. So again, let's go ahead and make sure our plugin is enabled. It's pretty excited about this one. I mean, I'll see. Okay, so that's good to go. Everything's good. So we'll go to add. Let's go to metahuman identity and we'll just call this JJ. That's gonna be me. So I'll go ahead and double click right here. And let's go ahead and add that component and I'll say J ready mesh. Now I have to zoom in in here and let's go ahead and change this to 20. There you go. So that's a pretty good one right there. I'll go to unlit right now. So you can see that looks pretty good. Kind of helps with the tracking, I guess. Press this plus button again, right click auto tracking. And that's pretty much instant right there, which is pretty darn cool. All right, so it caught the eye right here, as you can see. So that's good. Uh, let's see what happens in the actual meta, meta human creator, though. So I'll go ahead and lock this off right now, lock camera, and then we'll click on this identity solve. And that's it. Wow. And then I'll go to body again. We'll, cho we'll choose the normal weight body and then click on mesh to meta human. That's pretty much all live. I didn't pause the video or anything. That's how quick it is. Pretty much on how to turn yourself into a meta human. As long as you have a photo scan asset of yourself, usually like a phone or whatever, or if you have like a sculpt. Okay, so while we're waiting here, I'll go ahead and load up bridge. So go ahead, make sure I'm and make sure I'm kind of logged in, which I already am the meta human right now. This is the one that we created earlier. All right, your MetaHuman is now available in the creator. And as you can see, it's loading up right now, actually. So I'll click on that and start MHC. Now, sometimes it might take a long time for this because there is a lot of people using this tool. I remember last year when it first released, <laughs> it was really hard to get in the server, but it's a little bit faster now, I think. As you can see here, place hold while we connect you to the MetaHuman creator. This may take a few minutes. Yeah, this is so fun. I, I haven't had this much fun since, like... And here we are. Here is the meta human me rigged up. I think the eyes did pretty darn well. And let's go ahead and edit selected. Yeah, I was kind of worried about the eyeball there, but it looks like it did pretty well. So I'll press stop here now. Obviously, the shape of my face is not like that. And if I go ahead and enable editing, unlock it, this is actually going to let me change some stuff around. Like the jaw, I don't really have that. I have like a, you know, I'm trying to make myself look skinny here. And again, you can mess around with this a little bit more if you want. Um, but I don't want to mess up too much in the neck area. You should not mess around with that. And what's cool about this is if I change this slider out here, it's going to be less and less me, as you can see. But if you want it as close to your meta as possible, you'll have to go to the right. And this is also going to let you move some stuff around like in the previous version. So again, I'm just trying try to make myself look skinny here. Because this is the metaverse after all, right? All right. Yeah, so I don't want to change too much. And again, my head right here, I have like a, that's pretty, that's pretty accurate. <laughs> that's pretty darn accurate right there, dude. Oh, uh, no, let's see. Okay, yeah, uh, that's pretty good. All right, so in the chin, I'm going to give myself a, no, I don't want to mess with that. I'm going to control Z that. Okay, so, uh, that's so funny. Now, I can blend this as well, but I'm not going to do that because I'm just going to get further and further away from my actual character. So maybe I can change the ear a little bit because my ears, man, they're not that big. I mean, they're big, but like not like that. 
This is so freaking cool. And again, this, to make something like this before would take very, very talented people. So it's, again, what this is doing, it's just letting me, you know, I don't know how to model. It's just kind of, I don't have to worry about that anymore. You know, I can just make a character and make him look unique. And that's pretty much it. I think I just made that too flat. So I'm going to be happy with that for now. And again, we'll apply the skin here. So I'll, I'll sign, and it's going to create its own texture. And for the texture, I can actually make myself old, which is kind of cool. Going to remove that. Look at that. That is so dope. So, I mean, obviously, this is where you can kind of play around, de-age myself if I want to. And it looks like they actually added some more textures in here. Looks kind of good. I'm not, I'm not trying to like make it look like me 100%. Because, you know, I want it to look cool. Just created like a different version of me. My skin tone is kind of like hard to get to. That looks pretty cool. Oh, it's, I think it's too much, too much texture. And again, this is non-destructive. I can come back here and keep editing this if I want to. So, and then for the eyes, it's pretty cool. Stick with a black one like that. That's <laughs> so cool. <laughs> that is one ugly meta human, dude. Man, that is crazy. All right, so let's go check out the head. Some hair. Style. All right, this is the fun stuff. Ooh, give himself some cornrows, dude. Yo, look. Freaking cool. Uh, let's get some. <laughs> Wait, I want some snipes. Oh, God, that's nightmare, man. Yo, look at that. Check out that hair. You know, funny story. I have that haircut when I was in middle school, bro. Little insight there. So yes, my yearbook picture looked like that. Yo, look at that. Yo. So dope. Let's see if I if Keanu hair looks good on me. Okay, that's not bad. I think I like this one better. Okay. So eyebrows. I'm not gonna like touch any of that. Maybe some mustache? Do I look good at oh <laughs> Bro, no, bro, no, bro. Come on, why? <laughs> yeah, okay, let's not go there. Let's go with the long message. Oh, no, nah, dude, I ain't trying to do all that. Yeah, no, okay, so we'll just have that. Portions. Do they have an option for like a 12 pack? Because I see there's a six one in there. No. All right, whatever, man. I'll just pick that. All right, let's look at some clothes. Oh, gosh. I'm, you know what? I'm going to leave this empty because I'm going to be using my own clothes. I'm not going to play with this. I might give you mm, some sneakers, though. Oh, that's some nice sneakers. This is definitely new sneakers. I do not remember that. Looks like we got our meta human here. And now if I click on back right now, that's going to save it to my folder. Man, 
But yeah, that's pretty much it. What I'm going to do now is, you know, try and see if I can get some renders out of this.